same as the day we find out who is best and who goes home dead. <laughs> I am Paul Saborin, my color commentarian, immediately to, uh, almost immediately to my left, he walked away. Keith Baker. Hi, bro. <laughs> Today's headline Top Gun match. In the purple box. <laughs> The straw-headed man, but don't confuse him for a straw man. Oh, no. The uh, guy who... Uh, <laughs> abuse! 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 abuse. <laughs> <laughs> that's his parenting comment. That's his boo. Abuse. <laughs> My life partner for almost 21 years. <laughs> <laughs> the quiet storm Nika Stanzo And in the white box the man with an entire cruise named after him yet he's still somehow unsatisfied <laughs> The Sadiator Gladiator <laughs> The fearless Nerdist, Jonathan Creepy Doll Colton! They are full of caffeine, they are angry at one another, and they are ready to deal. Gentlemen, are you shuffled and ready? I will remove your boxes. Please fight, no hitting below the belts. Okay, Keith, do you want to... Uh, Make any comments as they start. Do we do we care to tell them what type of decks they're playing? We want to just see how this plays out. It's going to be an interesting match. Jonathan's playing a white and life game deck. Uh, it gets life every time people put creatures out. But Storm's playing a deck that only has four creatures in it. <laughs> <laughs> This is appropriate because Jonathan d does live one of the whitest lives that I know. <laughs> Mulligan. They have called Mulligan. That is house rules. They are redealing with no penalty to either player. This makes for some stellar stagecraft, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> The last time I saw these two play, one of them won. <laughs> there's, there's no lost love between these two, ladies and gentlemen. And they're still shuffling. Keith, this shuffling technique is actually very <laughs> So, anybody from out of town? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, uh, how about we hurl a little abuse to hurry up the shuffle? Abuse! 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 abuse. abuse. Derision! Derision. <laughs> Meta no. abuse from up top. <laughs> Compliment! Disagreement! <laughs> Argument! Rebuttal! <laughs> Rebel, rebel, rebel. Irrelevant if comment! If decides to, to redeal, they would be facing a one-card penalty at this point. Storm has declared he is good. Jonathan, are you good? I'm also good. Jonathan, Jonathan is good. Got five. Wait, wrong game. Who goes first? Who goes first, Keith? I declare you. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> Those are your most scientific <laughs> point flips. You're <laughs> All right, let us uh, question the crowd as we find out the first all-important card he plays. This sets the tone for the entire match, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. Swamp. Oh, right side. I don't draw. I forgot. He's already screwing up. <laughs> now, what do these cards mean? <laughs> That's oh, upside down. We have to follow all their cards. A straight draw happening here. So <laughs> I'm going to play a planes card. This deck is all white. So that's that's true. true. That was not entirely unexpected. No, that's true. That's true. See a lot. And is that our turn? Uh, yeah, that's my turn. Okay. And we go to Storm. Who draws a card? Everyone, we say draw. As I have one. And I tap a tap a tap it. 
Oh. I play brainstorm. Brainstorm. Keep. Go ahead and read off what brainstorm does. Brainstorm allows him to draw three cards and then put two of them back on top of his deck. So it gives him more choice about what to do. Okay. Uh, and this deck has a whole lot of different draw mechanics, so he gets to go through things quickly. Draw mechanics. Does that mean he's going to be making like some cat illustrations during that's, this game? That's why we have the whiteboard. Out. Okay, that's good. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> and that is his turn. We turn back over to John. I'm going to draw. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, everybody. I think we can stop declaring that over the microphone. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna put another plans down here. Oh, bold move. Uh, let's see. I saw a card go by there, I thought it said Hall of Oats. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it is a white deck. <laughs> uh, Alright, I'm going to tap one of these, I'm going to play my Soul Warden. Put my Soul Warden into play here. This is a human cleric. Whenever another creature enters the battlefield, you gain one life. This is a very... You want to talk about the mechanics of this deck, then? Yes, it's a very typical card for this deck, which is all about giving him as much life as possible. If he can get to 50 life, there is a card that will let him win right away. Ooh. Believe in the heart of the cards. Uh, I'm also going to put out, uh, sorry, I'm also going to put this uh, artifact out, these uh, Claws of Gix. That's a free play, right? That's there. a free play, which is very exciting for me. <laughs> this artifact lets him uh, pay to destroy any card he controls to gain one life. <coughs> it doesn't seem very useful, but you might see an interesting play from it later. And is that turn? That's turn. All right. Over to store. We'll draw. Oh. <laughs> Do that every single time. <laughs> 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 All right. Okay. All right. <laughs> I play a power tip. <laughs> now he's got both colors in his deck. And I'm going to tap that mountain. <laughs> Cast a lightning bolt. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Lightning bolt! <laughs> lightning bolt! Lightning bolt! That's a nice smart app brought to you by Paul lightning Store, bolt. available on all online for all major smart devices. Lightning bolt! At Soul Warden. Now. Uh, okay. Uh, is it very good? Yes, yes, indeed. Uh, okay. I am going to, uh, I'm going to do this. I'm going to pay one mana. I'm going to use my Claws of Gix to sacrifice my Soul Warden. I'm going to gain one life. So while he can save the Soul Warden, he managed to turn it into an extra point of life for himself. I believe it was Jewel who asked, who will save your Soul Warden? <laughs> hey, this job doesn't pay well, so shut up. <laughs> Over to Jonathan, who will. Well, well, first he will upkeep, and then he will exact a bloody vengeance. Sorry. Ah! Oh, sorry. I'm going to play at planes. Oh, hold on, I have to move my card to the other side of the street. <laughs> He's kind of alarmed to set his. Move his car to the other side of his Brooklyn street so he doesn't get a ticket. <laughs> uh, okay. I'm going to uh, tap two of these guys, put down a uh, wall of omens, which is a creature, 0 4 creature, wall, wall creature. Wall of Omens was also an excellent album by Styx, uh -huh. 1979. It also, uh, I draw a card when it is. So he will. Oh. And that's turn. Alright. I draw. Oh. <coughs> <coughs> yeah. I'm 
heard this laugh before, ladies and gentlemen. I think something interesting is going to happen. <laughs> Plague an island. <laughs> <laughs> interesting. And then, I think, because my math code processor is working so well right now, I'll have to check this. Yes, I am going to <coughs> tap two and play Pyretic Ritual, which is an instant, and it will add three red to my mana pool. Ah, shit. <laughs> and with that, those three red and one, as it happens, blue uh, mana, which I tap. I'm playing Empty the Warrants. And this is a sorcery in which I put two 1-1 one, one goblin creature tokens into play. Now, it has the storm effect, which means that when I play this spell, I copy it for each spell played before it in this turn. Is instant a spell? Yes. Anything but a land is a spell. So I played one spell before I played it to the board, meaning that I am able to um, copy it, meaning I now have eight Goblins. No. no. Oh, I see. My math co-processor, whose name is Keith Baker, <laughs> has correctly applied the goblins. Thank you, Keith. Uh, they are sick at the moment. Oh, no. oh, don't cry for the goblins. They're really unpleasant. <laughs> but they are, uh, they are staring at the wall. Spells that I cast cost 
what, one less to cast. So it's an efficiency. You know? It's basically a coupon card. <laughs> uh, oh, no, I'm it. I just want to put that out there. And I attack with my goblins. Ooh. First attack of the game, ladies and gentlemen. Interesting. Interesting. <laughs> Four goblins. Uh, wait, can I block with one uh, creature? Uh, yes, each one of these is in the this one. Right. So you can only block one of them. So they block one, this can block one, two, right. 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 you get That's what I'll do. I'll block two. One is killed by uh, the Aether Wrist Watcher. So when you drop down to three, one is blocked by the wall, and then you take two points of damage. First blood! Lightning bolt! For what it's worth, you're still above your starting token. And also, since we have actually seen some blood, I think that calls for uh, some some bloodthirsty... We're, we're happy to see the blood. Ah! Ah! I've never seen my hair from the back before. I'm just kind of spending a little time with this. It's a lot curlier than I imagined. All right. Oh, that was me. Okay. I'm untapping. That's that's the next move I make. That's true. Spoilers. Draw. Oh my goodness. Such language. <laughs> Such cards. All right. Uh, I'm gonna play another uh, wall of omens here. Ooh. Oh, this guy drops to two. My Haven Rift Watcher. Uh. I'm going to, uh... Oh, right, I gotta draw a card because of my wall of omens. Ooh, uh, why the shoe that bear the wall? <laughs> that was for all us old people. Uh, I'm gonna drop out this other clause of Hicks, because why not? Can't have too many clause of Hicks, I always say. <laughs> that old saying, right? <laughs> uh, and then... Uh... Yeah, I'm going to attack with my Avon Rift Watcher. So what's that, Keith, what's the strength on that Avon Rift Watcher? It's a 2-3, but it's flying, so Storm can't block it. Could he maybe throw things at it as it goes by? Maybe, but will he? <laughs> I will. <laughs> oh. <laughs> It's a hit, a palpable hit! Oh. Oh. <laughs> I'm beginning to understand the reason for this event. It's to promote your... My bloodlust, yes. <laughs> no, it's to promote your goddamn app. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's turn. Uh, I draw. I'm not surprised. <laughs> <laughs> It's a card. And I play this mountain. Yeah. <laughs> Woo! The absolute best card of the three that I was able to see. Okay. All right. Well, Storm considers his play. Let me ask a very important question. Do either of you need more coffee? Yes. Yes. Coffee boy! <laughs> coffee boy! Let us appoint a coffee boy. Is that me? <laughs> I was suggesting maybe your son. <laughs> okay, Tara, would you please kindly get some coffee for our gentleman? Something kind sweet tree? for store? Do kind tree? Something sour. Something sour for gentlemen. Sure, so a bottle of vinegar and a cookie? That's it. Tara Heller, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Oh, there you are, hiding behind me. That's why she couldn't find you. <laughs> yeah. I got these three goblins. I got it. these three goblins. I got these three goblins. Let me tell you. I don't know what to do with them. Arrow walls. Arrow walls. 
goblins. Uh, in go the goblins. In go the hey, goblins. Here come the goblins. All right, I'll block two and uh, take one. All right. All right. Thank you, buddy. All right, I got you right where I want you. Back at your original life total. <laughs> Sure. I don't think I'm revealing too much when I say that I'm really hoping for a land. Okay. Oh, he's got that smug look I've seen many times before. I believe Storm has all your land. <laughs> Thanks for taking all my land. All your land are belong to me. <laughs> Oh, you're getting you. One, uh, one, e one upkeep left for uh, Aiden Rick Watcher. We hardly knew you. Silly me for trying to touch a thing. <laughs> it's not play killing me defensive. Uh, okay. Let's do this. Uh, I'm going to play my uh, recumbent bliss enchantment on your uh, goblin electromancer. So this means the goblin electromancer cannot attack or defend. It does still give Storm the benefit of reducing the cost of his spells, but it also gives Jonathan one life at the start of his upkeep every turn. Uh, and then I'll attack with my ever vanishing. Even Riv Forger. Hmm. Hold on, Keith. <laughs> Not so fast with that Sharpie. <laughs> Just got interest. Not sure how much I value my life. That's the question. Yeah, right. Even Riv Forger will enter Jonathan's world. Um, the the Riv Forger will disappear at the start of the next round. Yes. So it's only a round for this attack. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take that hit. I'm going to take that hit. Uh, yeah. Possibly because I had it. Yeah, possibly. possibly. Maybe it was strategic, though. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Probably not. Uh, that's my turn. It's <laughs> always oh, just what I want. Uh, I'm playing the land, uh, an island. Woo! It's ironic. You're getting all the lands, and I'm getting none of the lands. You know? It's ironic. Sure. Right. Isn't that ironic? <laughs> <laughs> Don't you think? <laughs> I need a land. <laughs> Your opponent draws a land. <laughs> <laughs> you play your goblin electromancer, and he enchants it with recumbent bliss. <laughs> Rift Watcher has one life left. <laughs> <laughs> That's my turn. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. Uh, I attacked with my goblins. I love these guys. These guys are so great. I blocked two of them and take one. <laughs> Tara's back with cookies and coffee. Yay! I'll have what he's having. All right. So I'll keep uh, this guy goes, but I get two life when he goes. Bye, Avon Rift Watcher. Bye. Oh, wait. One time he can sacrifice him. Oh, he can sacrifice him. He disappears. Right. Hang on there, Avon Rift Watcher. Wait, we're going to sacrifice him. Untap, upkeep. Sorry, Reaver. So untap. I'll pay this. Another life. Another life, so I get three. And one from the enchantment. And two hot boiled eggs. <laughs> and one to grow on. Bye. The new pal right there. Audience keeping us honest. I know, I love it. Ladies and gentlemen, our rules lawyer over in the corner. <laughs> uh, now I'm going to draw a thing that's not a land. Draw a law firm of mana, 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 and mana. <laughs> and upkeep. Uh, okay. Uh, 
Okay, let's do this. Uh, Soul Warden, whenever another creature comes into play, I gain one life. She's ready. Uh, and uh, that is my story. Uh, I'm about to play a mountain. <laughs> I am the land baron. I love land. I hate playing things that can damage my opponent. Ah, <laughs> uh, gosh. Yeah, I don't mind those walls. Woo! Uh, three. <laughs> <laughs> three stops? Yes. Uh, okay. I am attacking with my Yay! Goblin! Uh, I will block two of them. This is an exciting surprise. This is an amazing game, everybody. <laughs> 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 oh, yeah. Well, it is for him. Now it's coming. I got yeah. it. You're on the line. Only Andy was just like. Uh, okay, that's. Wait, I barely know who won, so it's my turn. Alright, there's my life. From the. No, from the. Yeah, from, from the list. Oh, yeah. Yeah, right on. Uh, okay. I'm going to put into play the Suture Priest. Whenever another creature enters the battlefield under your control, I gain one life. Uh, whenever a creature enters the battlefield under its opponent's control, that player loses one life. Oh. And I get one for putting the Suture Priest in because of my Soul Warden, so I get two, two life down my way. Alright. Alright. Well, it's... Indeed. There's limited sets, terminal out. Uh, Feel free to shout out unsolicited advice from the background. Bad advice! Bad advice! I'm not going to attack. I'm not going to attack. Right I'm going to hang tight. Tap all your cards. I attack my goblins and I draw. I have a question. Was only Storm yet coughing? Is that what's happening? From me. No, it's got sugars in it. <laughs> Cream no sugar, please. I would get it myself, but I'm in the middle of a magic gathering. <laughs> <laughs> Tapping one island to play Brainstorm, which allows me to drop three. We've seen this spell before. This is one of Storm's favorite tactics. <laughs> Uh, 
and that's my turn. I gotta put the wikis on the board. I'm good. Those of you who can't see the board, it is currently 29, Jonathan, 16, Storm. I don't untap my goblins because I forgot to tap them. I play Brainstorm. That's the third Brainstorm of this game. I, I just love that card. And I'm going to do some of this and some of that. Put a noodle in my hand. <laughs> Start's always good for those 1912 phrases. Like, little of this, little of that, put a noodle in my hat. <laughs> or were you actually requesting a noodle for your hat? We can send Tara out. Would you like a sweet or sour noodle? Go, Stormy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I believe you. Alright, uh, tap two to put out another Goblin Electromancer. Ooh. Alright, that. Uh, I've done this. I've done this. Now, your arbiter's going to have been a brave tactical It's going to make you lose one life, by the way. Ooh. Because I have this uh, future priest. Because you have that <laughs> asshole. <laughs> <laughs> I made, a, I made a terrible mistake, but I'm going to live with it. I'm going to tap two more. Oh, and I gain life, right, because of my soul work. Thank you. You gain two life. Oh, no, just one. No, he loses one. I gain. Gabriel is terrible terror. Um, oh, I attack my goblins. Great. That's three. Three one ones coming at you. Okay. Uh, I'm going to block uh, two of them. Which negates the one life you gained. Uh, right. And then I'm going to... Uh, with, with that tap down that I just tapped, cast Pyroplasm, which deals two damage to each creature. Uh, oh, right, I don't have anything to do. Okay. Right. For so these guys, these guys are dead. And my error was I played my Goblin of Electro Mansion <laughs> before oh, playing right. the card that kills everything. Oh, that's too bad. <laughs> Unless it was a tactical move. It might have been. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see. Now, right now, the walls each take two points of damage each. And I'm going to go ahead and tap two more mana. Are you going to attack my injured walls? <laughs> oh. I, I, I can't see them suffer that way, and I'm casting another pirate class. <laughs> like, at the Battle of Jericho, wow. the walls have come a tumbling down. <laughs> so now there is nothing on the battlefield. <laughs> <laughs> That's my turn. All right. Thanks a lot, Dick. <laughs> <laughs> Survival cash has rebound. Thank you. Survival cash, Survival has, cash has rebound. That gives you two more life. Reminding me now. More than twice Storm's life. I, and I love that you guys are out there taking care of this. <laughs> so <laughs> this, this means I get to, I get to uh, uh, cast this from exile without paying for it. Which means I get under two life. Uh, I draw a card. <laughs> well, you only draw a card if you have more life than Storm. Uh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> Uh, all right, let's just so I have a thing. All right, I'm gonna play this uh, squadron hawk. One one with flying. I get to search my library for up to three cards named squadron hawk. How many do I want? I'll take one. I, I have uh, four. I'll take uh, or five. But. Uh, yeah, find me, find me two good if you know what I'm saying. I already have one in my hand, for God's sake. <laughs> uh, spoiler alert. Spoiler alert. Uh, and I'm going to put another one into play as well. And that's my turn. This would be an excellent time to play Pyroclasm. <laughs> 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 
sure if you're playing the obvious strategy of trying to win. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's how this game works. <laughs> How's it going, Storm? Yeah. A lot of, a lot of land. I like I love land too. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's my shirt. <laughs> Let's, let's get some abuse down here to get them to play. Abuse! Abuse! Play better, awesomer cards, please. You all suck. Okay, <laughs> let's see. Oh, uh, sure, use land. Still, still looking for land. No problem. No problem. Uh, soul Warden. Uh, I know. Move for the Soul Warden. I'm going to uh, put this Basilisk collar equipment, which gives the creature death touch and lifelink. Uh, I'm going to equip it to the squadron hawk. And, and why are you tapping your cards? <laughs> and now you're making me think twice about what I'm doing. But I'm going to go... I'm gonna, I'm going to go ahead with it anyway. I'm going to attack you with both of my squadron hawks. Perhaps to make this turn more dramatic, can you give uh, each of your squadron hawks names so that when they die, <laughs> they feel a little bit more for their loss? No, Terry. Terry, the, the one with the basilisk collar is named Terry. The one without it is named Sal. <laughs> hey, hey, Sal. Hey, hey, Sal. So sorry you're going to this, Terry. I cast lightning bolt on Terry. <laughs> Lightning bolt! Lightning bolt! <laughs> <laughs> I made the app and I'm starting to get tired of it. <laughs> Done. Okay. Uh, Terry dies. Sorry, Terry. Oh. Hi, Terry. Hi, Terry. Hi, Terry. <laughs> Terry was a jerk. <laughs> <laughs> On Sal, event Terry. That's a lot. I have a lot of life. <laughs> if we were playing Risk, you would be kicking ass right now. <laughs> <laughs> you could lobby. You could lobby Keith to switch the game right now to Risk. <laughs> <laughs> all right. I play this card, which transforms all lands into awesome cards. <laughs> oh yeah, a uh, Storm's Whim. That's right. A Storm's Whim. <laughs> Oh, I forgot. Its other effect is to just turn it into a mountain, which I play. <laughs> That's my turn. All the other creatures. Okay. Still, still no lands. <laughs> Avenge Terry. Yeah. Avenge Terry, yeah, absolutely. I agree with you. We're all still hurting about Terry's, uh... Terry's disappearance. Terry was he just, he just sort of vaporized and his collar just dropped to the battlefield <laughs> empty. Uh, let's see. Let's play. And put another squadron hawk out there. Oh, this is Terry's brother Jerry. Just got into the Squadron Hawk Academy. <laughs> He's a little green. They call him I gave one life for that. Uh, that creature coming out. I mean, you know, so in far. theory. Uh, and that... Sure, I'll attack you with my uh, squadron hawk and my soul uh, I, I, I am not going to block them for strategic reasons. Terrific. Perhaps you could put up all of your mountains in their way and leave me. Thirty-two to twelve. <laughs> are you guys? You guys are just. You've already played this game through in your heads to the end, right? This is board two. Creeping towards victory. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, so right, that's my turn. All right, that's right where I want you. Uh, All of my lands are out at this point. I'm fairly confident. <laughs> I know we have a sound for this, a sound part. I'm playing Mountain. <laughs> and that's my turn. <laughs> Storm appears 
be playing a very long con here. <laughs> Okay, everybody, it's a land. Woo! 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 Uh, it's another uh, career crossroads, so I get uh, two life here, and they're just taps. So two life so far. Uh, ten, ten life just because, why not? All right, uh, I'm going to put another uh, squadron hawk, Barry. Barry, yes. <laughs> Barry, Jerry, and Sal. Sal, Sal has legally changed his name to Larry. <laughs> uh, oh, I have to pay for that, presumably. Uh, and uh, I will attack you with my three squadron hawks. I. Oh, sorry, I can't because he's sick. Uh, I'll attack you. Uh, I'll attack you. I strategically. Yes. Hold my ground. Good for you. <laughs> 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 He's down to half of his own. <laughs> <life. laughs> <laughs> <laughs> oh, This is an important draw, ladies and gentlemen. If this is another mountain, I am going to weep for scorn myself. <gasps> draw. Draw. Ah, scorn has drawn something that is marginally more helpful than a land, I believe. I want to tap and put this into play because I can. <laughs> it is a it is pyromancer ascension. So when I cast any instant or sorcery that has the same name as a card. I put a quest counter on Pyronance for Ascension. And when it reaches two uh, counters, I uh... <laughs> <laughs> It's an excellent spell if you'd drawn it ten rounds ago. <laughs> <laughs> and if there were one of my graveyard already, that would count, but it doesn't. So, um... So what's, what's happening? Nothing is happening. Right. <laughs> Basically, a wizard walked out into the battlefield and went... Poof! <laughs> <laughs> and it would be it would have been awesome if I had that instead of one of these ten billion lands. Yeah, what does it actually do on that terrible deck? If you can set it up, which you would have done by casting these brainstorms, for example, yeah. Yeah. any time you cast a sorcery or instant, you would get a copy of it. I so see. Cast it twice, yeah. and it would have triggered with all these various things great. done. Mm -hmm. but, mm -hmm. So basically, that's the Kinko's card. Yes, and that's my turn. Okay. Okay! Here we go! Uh, uh, magic hit! <laughs> You's about to get magic, my friend. <laughs> How much mana does Jonathan have? All mana. Five. It's the, currently five. Oh, okay. It's like the Walmart of mana. <laughs> Jonathan has a palette of mana. <laughs> a plethora. A plethora of mana. Uh, yeah, let's see. Okay. Uh, I'm going to play this, uh, five, five. This last week. <laughs> decided to live with his oh, mistake. No, no, no. no, no, no. <laughs> My decision stands. I believe actually Storm chose to die because he's sick. Alright, so there's uh, Stormfront Riders. Uh, I am going to... Uh, yeah, sure. Oh, no, I can't. Alright, I'm going to attack you with my... Uh, Just what he needs, one more life. I'll <laughs> uh, thank you, the squadron hawk, and the soul warden. 
I. That's Sal, by the way. Sal. Well, guess what? Sal's going to hit me for damage. <laughs> Woo! Go, Sal. Storm is down to single digit life, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, yes. Good. Okay, that's my turn. Now, is there a mechanic where if you get more life than your current age, something special happens, like a cake comes out or something? How old are we? I tap free and play Boson Strip. And when I tap it until the end of the turn, if the top card is any of the things that I have, uh, that I can play it as though it were in my hand. And if I do so, that card goes out of the game. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and do that. Yeah, it was stuff. Uh, so I need to tap three. Oh, right, because that is that. So, so I have tap three, so I can play this card at the top of my deck, which and I have a worker on my die, which at the moment means nothing. Stormfront, I guess. And I, uh, I lightning bolt Stormfront. Lightning bolt! He does. Um, or she. And that's what you're oh. Yes, it is. And that gives me three red mana in my hand. Red mana is 
Personal. Now it's personal. It wasn't before. <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay, hold on. Thinking, thinking. Don't make us yell abuse again. <laughs> I don't want any abuse. Compliment. Keep. <laughs> so much scrying going on, ladies and gentlemen. We have not seen this much scrying since the Great Battle of 89. <laughs> 
which oddly happened in 2009. <laughs> so for one red map, he has just gained six red map. Ooh. Ooh. Would you care for a lightning bolt? Hemstar. Hemstar. Okay. Star. Star. So Star. he now has two lightning bolts. You could hit his sad uh, squadron hot score just to six damage. Alright, now we have to get rid of you. Yeah, you are. Uh, so we still have six red mana plus four five. Alright, so we are now getting four brainstorm. <laughs> <laughs> as it sounds, because he actually just gets to draw the same three cards, essentially, multiple times. So, <laughs> <laughs> like to I think we can all agree this is not as exciting as it sounds. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's just about as exciting as it sounds. <laughs> I don't know, I'm pretty excited. Yeah, this is exciting. Can get two of them? Yeah. Uh, get two of them, yes. Okay. The rules lawyer is over here, sir. <laughs> this is like the worst Ricky J routine ever. <laughs> hey, look, those same cards. Two guys randomly paw some cards for a while. <laughs> 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 Alright, one last one. <laughs> <laughs> you haven't played land yet this year. Alright. Yeah, definitely play land. <laughs> <laughs> Start playing another map, everyone! Mountain, 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 mountain. Would you like to do this? <laughs> okay, so uh, what is so happening now? This is two mana. Putting you now to uh, two mana left in your, your ongoing pool. Five available. Okay. Absolutely. Uh, so, uh, yeah, it's it's in here. Uh, empty the Warrens. He's casting again. He's already cast seven spells this round, so that gets him 14 goblins. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and that gives him another 16 goblins. I think I speak for all of us when I say, What the Christ is going on? <laughs> <laughs> I was kidding about the 42 42. No, you were. I don't know what I'm doing. He has another copy of this spell. <laughs> So that means we're now left with 48 goblins. <laughs> Check how many goblins officially get 68. 68 goblins. Do you have 68 goblin markers in your pocket? Uh, no, but we will make it work. So these are digits, not actually. <laughs> just do this. Uh, yes, that is correct. <laughs> And he still actually, so that means... He still has 94 mana to spend. Remember how pissed you were about being a, a land baron earlier, Storm? Jonathan, what's your thinking right now? I really wish I had gotten some more lands in this game. <laughs> uh, I'm just here so I don't get fined. <laughs> You guys have been conferring and just randomly adding goblins. Let's see what, where are we at right now. Let's go over exactly how I'm getting fucked. <laughs> so this deck is the storm deck because he uses a mechanic called storm where when he casts a particular spell, it is duplicated for every spell he has already cast. A spell called Great Shot. Uh, it does one point of damage to a creature or a person duplicated for every spell he's already cast. So the first one does nine, uh, and he can, in the process, kill off. Darian's sound, I forgot. Darian's sound. Uh, but then he gets duplicated, and so then he gets to hit you for, so he gets you for seven, and then he gets you for another ten. So seventeen points of damage. Boom. Boom. Oh, that's four. And he already hit you for six, as I recall. Right? Uh, so that puts you to thirteen. Oh. Oh. Remember how bored we all were about ten minutes? Oh. Oh, here's a thing. Oh, here's a thing. Storm gets 87 more goblins. Uh, yes, I'm casting that again. 
happens. He can cast spells from the top of his discard pile. He casts it. Sure. It goes on his discard pile, where he casts it again. This time, actually inflicting more damage Great. because he's cast more spells. Good. So uh, you, just, you get another 21 points of damage. Okay. <laughs> oh. And he did not even actually use the 68 goblins. <laughs> Congratulate Keith Baker on his victory. <laughs> we are um, we're going to to break up into our individual games. I believe we only have uh, just over twenty minutes here in this room, so we may move those games to somewhere we can find space. Not positive where that is yet, but we'll make that happen. Thank you all for attending Magic with the Stars. That ended, I gotta say, unexpected. What a twist! I was really expecting that to end a lot more boringly than it did. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <it's> <laughs> I speak for all of us when I say shut up, Paul and Storm. <laughs> So that was great. Uh, so thank you all for coming out again. You can follow us like ducklings as we try and find a space if you want to watch any of the individual games that the people won for uh, for attending the tabletop taste test yesterday. Thanks again to Keith Baker for running this event. And please feel free to uh, to patronize the game room. Was sponsored by whom? Paul and Storm. Wait. Abuse. 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 No. 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 <laughs> Bring us the lions. <laughs> <laughs>